GM trademark. But I'll bet you didn't know that Leo the Lion is buried in an unmarked grave in Gillette, New Jersey. <laughs> has found that Leo the Lion is part of our life around here. If you were MGM, they would probably say we have no idea where Leo's buried. Not anymore. What had been a little-known secret for more than half a century became public knowledge this morning. Yes, here lies the MGM lion, here on the site of the old Pfeiffer Animal Farm. Bony Pfeiffer was one of the greatest animal trainers of his life. People would come to see him and Leo as they tour the country. Bony died 20 years ago, but his love for Leo is legendary. That animal meant an awful lot. It's like you with your own nose. It's very important to you to look at it. And wipe it. And that's the same way it's one for that to buy and play. It's a very interesting analogy. It is. That's something you never heard before. No. <laughs> The point is, Volney loved Leo so much, he had him brought back here to New Jersey and buried him in his front lawn. They planted a little tree next to the grave that day. It's been a long, long time. Fifty-six years Leo has rested here beneath the pine in the unmarked grave. Now there's talk of bulldozers and development, and local historians are a little worried that all this will be forgotten. Most people drive Pfeiffer's Animal Farm, or Volney Pfeiffer, or Leo the Lion, because there really is nothing here. What these people want is some kind of permanent memorial. They're worried all the stories of Leo and the Animal Farm will pass, when all the old-timers pass. They certainly stage quite a demonstration today to prove their point, and although their movement is beginning with a whimper, they promise it'll end with a... Steve Hart. Channel 7 Eyewitness News. And so Leo the Lion... Which leads us to the... Hey everybody, it's the Hometown Tales vidcast once again. We're out in the Jersey woods looking for more footage for our infamous Bigfoot segment, which is a year in the making. And uh, I'm not even sure it's worth the wait, but it, it will come eventually. Right now, speaking of woods and forests, uh, Leo the Lion, the famous MGM lion, he uh, has been known to to roam the woods, but more importantly, his grave. When he died, he was buried on an old abandoned farm just uh, close to us, right outside of Morristown, New Jersey. So we're going to show you that segment next, and I also want to remind you to go to hometowntales.com because black shirts are very popular, but they're even cooler if you get one with a little Hometown Tales logo on it. You can find that on our site, and if we sell enough, I can hopefully get a haircut, which I'm desperately in need of. I will put on my hometown tails hat. If we were uh, in a football stadium playing, this would be the hat that they sold in the parking lot for like five bucks. That's from Brian. Not really the logo. Really underground. Leo's Lost Grave on the Hometown Tales vidcast. Please email us, hometowntales at gmail.com. Check us out. Oh,